Hello YouTube and welcome to my tutorial. In this string of tutorials already, we're going to be going through a little bit about how to lay out websites using div tags and span tags and CSS and things like that. Today we're just going to go over div tags. Now, I want to point out that to do these tutorials, you should have a basic understanding of HTML already and I also want to point out that I am quite slow at typing so these tutorials could be very long but let's get started as you can see here I've structured a basic HTML page it's got HTML a head a title a closing head and some placeholder text here now what if we want to just style that well, we're going to need to put something after the body tag um, and before the head tag, that's the start of the web page and we're going to call this a wrapper div and divs allow you to style bits of the web page independently, just divs on their own won't do any styling but once you get into styling, you need to be using divs. So what we're going to do at the moment is create a div to wrap the page in, the whole page. So we're going to put the div immediately after the body. So first we're going to open a tag, and then we're going to write div space. We're going to give it an ID equal to open quotation marks, and we're just going to call this our wrapper div and then we need, just need to close the tag like you would on a link um, and then we need to put the closing div right at the end of the body because it's the end of the and for this one you don't need to put an ID um, and then what we need to do is start looking at our web page so we've got our H1 there and that that's our header so that ought to go in its own dip now once you start doing this it's important to kind of indent as you go so you don't lose where you are in the hierarchy so the next thing after the wrapper would be the header div uh, again following following the same principle just going the same And then what I will always t tend to do is again indent as I go because that might not seem necessary at the start but once you get into more and more divs it is. Um, and then at the end of that we're just going to put closing div again at the same level in the same level of indentation that I did in the and now we need to work out what this text is well it's our main content so we need to create a div called And we need to give it an ID of content and then we need to put the closing div at the end of the content which is just before 
the clothing of the rapper did because remember the rapper did wraps ev everything in our website just to make it easy. So we've got closing of the main content div. And then we're gonna, I'm just gonna add in a sidebar. Just because, so we're gonna do a div. We're gonna, give, we're gonna give it an ID of sidebar. I'm then gonna close the, close the div, obviously at the same level in the hierarchy. And then inside the div, I'm, I'm going to put a HTML element for an unordered list, which is just UL. And then we'll have home about. And now we'll make sure we we close that div which we have. So now we've got set styled up with divs. Um, let's look at what that looks like in our web browser. It just looks like our normal HTML page, and our sidebar is below our content, and it's not in the side. So doing divs clearly hasn't helped but study this tutorial be sure to wrap your, your content in divs and in the next tutorial you, you'll learn how to use CSS to style the divs to m actually lay out the site. Th thank you for watching and I hope this has helped you.